what's going on guys i know i have a great explanation but that's not what this video is about hi i know it's been forever i don't even know how to act on camera and i'm not even on a real camera i'm on my phone right now part of the reason why i've been missing but this video is about my hair so i flat on my hair for my birthday which is today november 19th happy birthday to me i'm that person who's always talked about their birthday no matter what age they're turning it's a good birthday so yeah so today's my birthday and i just wanted to show you guys how i flat on my hair if you are familiar with my channel you know that i did this last year as well on my birthday and that's the last time i flat ironed my hair which would have been a year ago so uh, if you want to check out that video i'll put it up in the cards or you can check the link down below in the description box but other than that let me just show you how i flat iron my hair Okay, so I started with clean hair. I shampooed and conditioned it, and I actually sat under the dryer for a little while. So my hair is about 60% dry here, and I'm gonna dry the rest of the way with the hair dryer. High blowing, high heat. I'm just going all in this time, because last time I was very cautious with my hair, and it still turned, it turned out good. Um, it just didn't last as long as I wanted to. So this time I kind of went all in just to see how much my hair could take. Anyway, so I just used the tension mission method here and I just pulled the ends of my hair and I blow dried the rest. It's really just the roots down to the middle of my hair that is still wet. Then using a comb, I'm just going to comb through my hair and then use the blow dryer again to get it a little bit straighter and a little more um, a bit dry and stuff like that. You know, the same thing, I guess, a comb and a blow, uh, a blow dryer would do. Uh, now here's when I noticed that my hair was a lot oil, a lot more oily than I wanted it to be. I had used oil after I used my leave-in and I'm realizing now that I probably shouldn't have done that, but I, you know, at this point I can't really go back. So I'm just going to keep on moving forward. So my hair was very moisturized, but it also had like an oily layer over top of it. But like I said, I can only move forward from this point here. I'm just combing through my hair. Um, it's completely blow dried and I'm just combing through, making sure I got all the spots, making sure it's dry, making sure it uh, combs through easily, everything like that. This is a wide tooth comb. I think it's called a shower comb I've never used one like this before and I really do love it so looking at my blowout I feel like I'm gonna be doing blowouts like it's just gonna be my thing <laughs> so now I'm gonna do a cool shot and this just closes the cuticle of your hair I never thought this to be very important until I talked to one of my beautician friends and she said it definitely does help locking in moisture and then of course we all have that fangirl moment <laughs> so uh, my blowout is complete my hair is dry and I'm just gonna go ahead and move forward okay so here most of my hair is done as you can see I put some rollers in the back I just kind of wanted to see the effect this is organics um, flat iron spray I've never used this and I wanted to try something that would protect my hair as well as assist in the flat iron process. So I just sprayed it all over that section. Then I'm going to comb it through with the wide tooth comb. And then I'm just going to section off my hair and, you know, go from bottom to top, flat ironing as I go. Uh, at my roots, I kind of went over a few times because my roots are very resilient and they're very thick. So I knew my roots could handle the heat as far as the ends I only went over my ends maybe about twice um, using the chase method just to give me a little bit more of a sleeker look my ends need a bad trim I'm realizing now that I haven't uh, had my hair trimmed in probably about three or four months and at this point it's definitely showing through and you can definitely tell that I need my hair trimmed badly so um, anyway like I said I probably went over my ends twice my roots maybe like three or four times and that's how I flat down my hair overall okay so all now that all the preliminaries are out of the way this is my hair just wrapped up I just wrapped it up because um I noticed that I put a little too much oil on it and I should have known better. My hair is fine and it gets weighed down very easily and I just, I wasn't listening to myself. I was just so excited and nervous about flat ironing my hair. All right, guys, if you want to hear about the products that I use for my hair and see me comb it down, make sure you check out part two of this video and also check the links down below, my social media, my blog and everything like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. See you in my next one. Bye.